Welcome. Hello, I'm Irini and together we will uh, try out one of uh, hands-on EU Code Week activities. As you know, we offer a lot of uh, activities in our EU Code Week website and today we will go through one of our challenges, cutting the EU Code Week bubbles. So open your browsers and follow me, we can do it together. Here's how to create your own motion control game step by step. First, log in to Scratch and create a new project. We will create an exciting game that uses your webcam as a motion sensor. Now, choose or create a sprite. You will get the scratch cut by default, which will do just fine to get started. But we decided to use the EU Code Week bubble as a costume for ours. Now let's position the sprite about at the center of the canvas. Next, make the game create clones of your sprite. Let's say every second until the game is over. This will make the game a bit more unpredictable and fun. To keep track of your score and the game's timer, we need to create two variables. Name one score and the other timer. Attach them to your sprite. Set the timer variable to 30, which will be the countdown for your game. Add a change timer by minus one block to make it countdown. Don't forget to tell the system to stop all interaction once the time is out and to reset the score to zero when the green flag is clicked. Now click Add an extension and choose Video Sensing. This will allow your game to detect motion. Now make the game give you a point every time you cut a sprite. Make it also disappear and reappear in a random position. And voila! With these steps, you've got to building blocks to create your own motion control game. Complete and customize it by adding your own sprite designs. Adding a game over, message at the end, and music playing wherever you want to. And now we created the game and let's play together!